Ninth Circuit copyright cases bring public attention to digital rights. Two recent copyright cases in U.S. federal court in San Francisco generated a lot of controversy in cyberspace. In the first case, defendants in Mandek Corporation embedded the pirated software in its Internet security products. The pirated software would display the name of the user and the message, one user license. Symantec sold the software to over 600 corporate and government customers. It even altered the file names to conceal the unauthorized use. However, the U.S. federal court dismissed the case by summary judgment. The court reasoned, since the plaintiff could not prove the defendant saw the one-user license message, there was no infringement. In the second case, defendant Sun Microsystems admitted that it had exceeded the software licenses. One Sun manager even warned that the piracy may cause trouble for the company. Again, the U.S. federal court ignored the evidence, including the copyrights registered in the programmer's personal name. The court entered judgment in Sun's favor and ordered the copyright owner to pay Sun large amount of attorney's fees. The courts made a broad holding that the restriction that one user can only use the software on one computer for each license purchase does not limit the scope of the license, and therefore, there was no infringement. This is a MJ News. Thank you for tuning in.